kind of a deja vu because it's a, it was a great day then and it will be a great day when Winnipeg hosts this year. 1972. That was the year the United City of Winnipeg legally came into existence. The Winnipeg Jets joined the World Hockey Association. And it's the last time the Winnipeg Blue Bombers hosted the Western Conference Finals. Only IG Field didn't exist. 49 years ago, Winnipeg local Walt McKee made his CFL debut kicking for the Blue Bombers. McKee tells City News that he soaked in every moment of that game. We played in the old Winnipeg Stadium, and I believe the attendance that day was around... 20,000 and it was a cool day in the middle of November so I have no idea what's going to be happening on December the 5th in Winnipeg but it was about minus six when we started the game and I think by the time we were finished the game was about um, minus 16. The Blue Bombers fell to Saskatchewan by a field goal in 72, missing their chance to advance to the Grey Cup, which ironically took place in Hamilton like it will this year. And according to McGee, there is a lot more similarities between the two Bombers teams. I kind of went down the list of players that we had in 1972 and I compared them to the players we have now. And many of them are almost replicas of the players today. And it was just amazing how they, they, they impart the enthusiasm and the, the people in the community are, are picking that up. This will be their first time hosting a divisional final since 2011 and the first Western final since 1972. And that community enthusiasm can be felt throughout the city. Bombers president Wade Miller says ticket sales are already skyrocketing. Even with winter weather looming, he's not worried. First of all, we're Manitoban, so we know how to dress for the weather. Um, you know, in our tailgate area is our warming hut, which we always have, fire pits out there. Uh, you know, there'll be specialty uh, drinks to keep you warm in the stadium and a few other things that we'll announce in the next uh, coming weeks as well. Regardless of all the serendipitous elements, the Western Finals will be a special day for all those cheering on the blue and gold. You don't see it very often and uh, it's great for our fans and great for the city and just going to be one heck of a day on December 5th. It's a, a great time of the year for Winnipeggers. Uh, it's been a tough time in, in the community for the last two years, and uh, it would be a great thing for all the community to get behind the Bombers on that December the 5th game and show them that it doesn't matter whether it's 40 below in Winnipeg or 40 above, we're going to be out there and support our team and get them to the Great Cup. After successfully getting the game changed to a 3 p.m. kickoff, Miller says there will be a free bus that will take fans from IG Field to Canada Life Centre for those who want to take in all the Winnipeg action on the 5th. In Winnipeg, Brianne Foley, City News.